Okay, so this seems to be a fairly common problem with the Mac Mini, and apparently the new M1 Mac Mini has got the same problem with a uh, bit of laggy, you get like the laggy mouse problem, uh, laggy keyboard, you'll be typing and you'll get some characters and you sort of, they stop and then they catch up again, that sort of thing. So um, before we go ahead, um, if you've got a USB mouse, this might come in handy in one of the steps. So uh, grab grab this because I'm not too sure whether you'll be able to get your uh, Apple devices back again if you don't have a USB mouse to manually uh, select them. So grab a USB mouse and we'll, we'll we'll go ahead and have a look at this. So here we go. I've got my uh, part of my desktop there on the right, and I've also got the Bluetooth uh, uh, section of the system's preferences there. As you can see, I've got my Apple Magic Mouse and Apple Wireless Keyboard uh, connected. So what you want to do is you want to uh, push down the uh, shift and option key and then the uh, Bluetooth, the Bluetooth one. So we'll go click on that and that gives you a uh, extended menu. Now what we want to do is we want to go to reset, uh, factory reset all connected Apple devices. There we go. And we'll come up with, if you want to continue, press OK. And there we go. So you've got not connected now. And uh, as you can see, can't move the mouse. So at this point, grab your USB, grab your USB mouse, put him in. I've got a little hub here, we'll put him in there. And then we can go over to the Bluetooth preferences. And I will reconnect the mouse. And I'll connect the keyboard as well. Click on that, and it comes up with a uh, code that you got to put in the keyboard. One, nine, one, three, nine, two. Press return, and that's connected. So I've got the uh, keyboard and mouse connected again. And one last thing I like to do is so you hit uh, press uh, shift and option again. Get into your Bluetooth preferences up the top there and I like to just go down to uh, reset Bluetooth module and I'll just reset it and clear it up again so uh, that usually helps as well so I'll hit that press OK and I'll reset it and it'll connect up again that should come up yep, there we go both connected again and that seems to clear things up for me um, I've noticed the mouse is working a lot better now and also the keyboard having any issues there. Uh, so there we go, guys. Um, hopefully, if you're having troubles with your M1 Mac Mini or the old Mac Mini, I've got the 2018 one. I've always had Bluetooth issues with it, with the keyboard and mouse. And this seems to fix it up a fair bit. Um, hopefully, fingers crossed, it doesn't come back again. Um, I usually notice that, that the mouse isn't too responsive, like... If you move it just like very slightly, yeah, I can see now that it's working quite well. If I move it very slightly, it's picking up. The resolution's really good. Usually when you've got uh, Bluetooth issues, uh, when, when you move the mouse, it's not too smooth. And also you'll, you'll notice that when you move it very slightly, it's, it lags. All right? So this is nice and responsive now. So I hope that fixes that. And... I hope it helps you out too. So, um, you know, drill, don't forget to like, subscribe and share. I'll see you next time. Cheers.